who does he think he is talking to us like we're idiots? We're not idiots. You gotta watch what you say, Mikey. Mr. Bennett, yeah, the big shot. The guy's old news. He's got ears everywhere. See, that's what I don't like. Okay, he tells us not to get anyone else involved, but then he gives us a quick inside job involving a friend of his and basically his entire company. You just gotta trust him. I don't know. Something's not right. It's simple, all right? We go in, tell the cashier the vending machine's out of Starburst. Skittles. Then... Was it Skittles? Yes. All right, whatever. We go in, tell the cashier the vending machine's out of Skittles. That's the cashier's cue. She gives us the money. We leave. Done. Yeah. Sounds real simple. A few grand isn't shit. But now we're dealing with tax fraud, too. Okay, that's a whole new ballgame. How are we gonna risk our next because this bozo can't handle his money for you? It's about favors, all right? We do this job, and then we get another, and another, and then we're rich. A favor? He's asking us to deal with the government, Jules. That's when you get hit with the real time, none of that three to five shit. It's a hell of a favor if you ask me. You want out? I can make the call no, right now. No, I don't want out. I'm already involved. All right, then quit talking about it. You heard what he said. Two Cokes, please. Uh, make mine a diet, please. Can I get a straw? There has to be an easier way. Why don't you try and loosen your shoulders up, okay? You're too tight. I'm not talking about bowling. I'm talking about an easier way to make some quick cash. All right, you've been begging me for months to get us a job, and now I get us one, and you're too afraid to do it? Mm. I'm not afraid of any job. I just don't want to be another one of Bennett's pawns. How many times do I have to tell you? Keep it down. What are you so paranoid for? No one can hear me. What happens if we get pinched? The owner's in over his head, all right? He needs the money. If we get set up, he doesn't get the money that we stole from him back. It's about the insurance. Okay, and how do you know we'll get our cut? Because of the insurance. That's the whole point. Yeah, cool. We don't need anybody bossing us around. There's plenty of small time shit that we can get our hands on around here, you know, just, just you and I. Like when we were kids. <sighs> can I just bowl? I don't want to talk about it anymore. Hey, I'm gonna get us a couple of Cokes, but seriously. Think about what I'm saying. Diet Coke. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, miss. Can I have a minute of your time? Do you bowl here a lot? Uh, on occasion. Who wants to know? Well, my name's Derek Scheitens, and I'm an intern with the Chamber of Commerce. And we've taken it upon ourselves to help local businesses in the area. If it's money you want, I don't have any. No, 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 not money. We're actually looking for bowlers to compete in the first ever Chamber of Commerce Couples Bowling Tournament. It's just a hobby. I don't, I don't really compete. Well, we already have our entire chamber signed up as well as their spouses and all the proceeds that go to the links. Look, man, I just want to come here, bowl, and relax, okay? Is that is that too much to ask? No, 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 it's absolutely understood, but um, while you relax, just here, take a flyer. And uh, just check it out and let me know what you think and if you want to get involved, and, and thank you for your time. You know, you know that, you know the thing you mentioned? What? The thing, our thing, not involving Mr. Bent. Dude, if you're coming to bust my balls, no. just save it. No, 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 I think, I think I got it, I think I got it. What? Got what? Okay, so in two weeks, there's a bowling tournament here on Saturday the 15th. It's a, it's About a, time. it's a couple, um, how much we owe you? Call it five even. Okay, um, there you go, keep, keep the change, thanks. 
Uh, dude, you just gave him a $5 tip. I just got a $5,000 tip. All right, come on. Okay, so in two weeks, there's the first ever Chamber of Commerce Couples Bowling Tournament. We live in the gutter, Jewel. We can't try and win any, like, tournament money. Of course we can't. That's the beauty of it all. They'll all be here with their spouses. Yeah, so what's your point? What do you mean, what's my point? They'll all be here. How do you not understand? We gotta go. Okay, listen. Shannon Timmons, President and CEO and her husband. Mike Carl and Chief of Staff, Community Relations, and his husband. Meryl Johnson, the Chamber COO, is also gonna be there. Daryl Street, the Treasurer, is gonna bring his wife. Gets the point, Jules. These are all members of the Chamber of Commerce, okay? They're gonna be here on yeah, Saturday yeah, yeah. the 15th. On Saturday the 15th, <sighs> 7 to 10, so what? What do you not get? They'll all be here, leaving their homes unattended, which gives us the perfect opportunity to get in, take what we want, and leave. We can't go too crazy, okay? Because if we do, it'll blow up in our face. We have three, four of these guys all in one night, all right? But we take small things. No flat screen TVs, major appliances, golf bags, bikes. Yeah, small things with high-end value. Things they don't use every day and have a bad habit in this place. Hey, you know, there's only one thing I don't know if you thought about, Jules. What? The kids. What if these people have kids? Hey, is this the Timmons residence? Oh, awesome. My name is Pam, and I am calling on behalf of the School Expansion Board Committee here in town. Uh-huh, yeah. Oh, I'm good. Thank you. Yeah. Yep. Hello. Well, we are actually oh, doing a survey on families here I'm in town. I'm calling on behalf uh, of the charter school. We just want to know, area. how many kids do you have? I was wondering, have? do you have any kids? Okay, uh, none? Oh, you do? Oh, that is, well, good for oh, you. Oh, great. Thank <laughs> okay, you so thank you so much. much. Yep, you do. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, did you bring the ski masks? Yeah. You're joking, right? Dude, I, I already paid to rent the van. You haven't paid for shit. I told you I was taking care of the gas. All right, fine. Take the tag off. I'll eat the six bucks. But I'm keeping a log. Don't let me down. As us stupid people are in the suburbs. Chill up, chill up. Hold on, give me a second. Give me a second. Mikey, Mikey, Mikey. No, Mikey, what the fuck are you doing? You go this way, and I'm gonna try this one. All right? All right.
are those? Uh, these things are worth a fortune on mine. Don't you remember these when we were kids? Oh, yeah, Beanie Baby. Yeah, still has the original tags on it. Look. Good job. Yeah, not bad. This nice screw gun. Uh-huh. Yeah. This blender. Oh, let me see that. Is that a ninja? <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Look at this thing. This is way nicer in person. I know. It's got all kinds of blades on it, doesn't it? Yeah. This could, like, make a bunch of smoothies and shakes and stuff. You could chop anything up, really. Yeah. Yeah. Smoothies are really big right now, though, so, you know. Before you say anything, research. Huh. Shut the fuck up. We're not taking their tools. It took us almost half an hour to get in here. I'm taking something. We're not taking their tools, Mikey. These guys are no different than you and I. Dude, it's all that's in here. All right, put the tools down. We got plenty of time. We'll get the next one good. Just one tool, man. No. Please, just one. Just. One. No! Just one, please! No! Please? Oh, you know what? Fine. Take one tool. One tool, that's it. Yes! Hey, you, you think I should take the saw or just, the level? Just, just pick a damn tool, all right? And let's get out of here. All right, don't hold back at all on this one, all right? Grab anything you see worth of value. What about the plan? We said we weren't gonna get greedy. I know what the plan is. I made the plan, all right? But we're running out of time and we haven't gotten much. Sounds good to me. Gotta be careful because if any pieces are missing, it's not worth any money. Man, why do you always talk to me like I'm stupid? I don't. Yes, you do, okay? We're gonna have to have a serious talk before we do anything like this ever again. All right, if you got something to say, why don't you just say it right now? We don't have time or I would. Uh-huh, that's what I thought. Okay, first, I come up with the whole plan, you give me zero credit, and then I don't, I don't buy your perfect fucking masks. And then black masks, the alarm goes Mikey. Off in the house. Black masks. Everybody knows it's black masks. What difference does it make if we're robbing empty homes? Oh my fucking god, dude, get over it. It was one house. Oh, one house. Fuck you. I would never have agreed to go tonight if I knew she was going to be. Honey, well, nothing is going on. How do you explain all the emails? We work together, of course we're going to email. You know, I email my coworkers too, but I don't use a ton of smiley faces when I do it. That's just her personality. If you would get to know her, maybe you'd realize that. I don't want to get to know her! Honey, nothing is going on. You have to trust me. It's her, isn't it? Answer it. It's Dan, probably wondering why we left her. Bullshit. Hey, I deserve some trust around. Here. And I deserve loyalty. I am loyal. Answer it! I'm not answering the phone while my wife and I are having a fight. It can wait. I don't care. Do what you want. I'm going to bed. You know, you should try putting yourself in my shoes for a change. Which pair? I sure as hell have bought you enough of them. Oh, you're an asshole. Hey, can this 
wait. Sorry. I know. I was having a lot of fun tonight, too. Of course she has an idea. She's not an idiot. That's why I didn't want to do this stupid charity thing to begin with. I... No, I'm not saying we have to stop. I'm just saying we have to be more careful. That's all. Babe? I have to go. I'll email you. Babe? us sometimes. No reason to worry, babe. Do you still love me? Yes, I still love you. You're my everything. Come to bed with me? Of course. I felt it.